What's up, people? This is William Jones making videos about leaving religion. The purpose of the videos is to make you start to think, you know, to turn your brains on and start to think and use logic and reason and realize religion isn't real. The purpose of this video is to talk about things that the Bible says that pretty much contradicts itself and doesn't make sense. For this one, I shall choose from Ecclesiastes, the verse that says at the end of chapter 1, you know, there is nothing new under the sun. Or in chapter 1, there is nothing new under the sun. You know, as Houdini says, there is nothing new under the sun. What you're doing now has already been done, right? So if there's nothing new under the sun, we can, we can go to a lot of stuff for that. How can you prophesy on something that's going to happen after you've said there's nothing new under the sun? How can Jesus be the only uh, son of a God to do miraculous things, right? They have 12 disciples and give his life. I don't know how you're giving your life when you're getting it right back, but die and come back three days later when there's nothing new under the sun. And if you do the research and look at the, even the books, there's even a book by uh, some guy, you know, we're talking about uh, the, uh, the, the uh, 16, uh, what, the 16 messiahs or something. This Jesus is not original. How could he be original? And in the same book you say, there is nothing new under the sun. If there is nothing new under the sun, then even what he did is not original. If there's nothing new under the sun, how can you prophesy something? Oh, men will be lovers of themselves rather than lovers of God. Didn't that happen way before that in earlier books? Is that not why uh, God flooded the earth and the Bible in the days of Noah? Because it was full of sin? So what were they doing that made him destroy the whole world? And then him turn around and say, I won't do it again because uh, you're only human. I won't do it no more. You know what I'm saying? So what changed? You flooded the earth for sin and we're still full of sin. Didn't work, so you try to flood it. That didn't work. I'm going to send my son. And he died. Still didn't work. We're still full of sin. There's nothing new under the sun. Oh, it's the end of the world. Why? Because of homosexuality. That's not new. You are just hearing about it. Guess what? There is nothing new under the sun. There's nothing new under the sun. How can you use the term there's nothing new under the sun and then bring up some new stuff? Men will be lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God. Uh, how do you love God? How do you love someone you can't see? And then I will say today, how do you love someone that doesn't exist? So they were just living life. That's what the rappers talk about, right? There's nothing new under the sun. But now, oh, oh, this is the end of the world. Why? Because this happened. But there is nothing new under the sun. So are you just hearing about it? Or is it new? Or is the Bible lying? Because if there's nothing new, why are you so shocked? Hmm. Think about that prophesying about things when there is nothing new. Shocked about things when there is nothing new. Oh, Jesus did this. 
There is nothing new. Jesus is not the only uh, story that follows this whole Messiah thing, astrology timeline. How do we know? Because your book says there is nothing new. So Jesus isn't new. Jesus is a stolen story from Egypt about Horus or Christian. Krishna, Dionysus, or Mithra, there is nothing new. Look at it for yourself. There's nothing, if there's nothing new, then don't be shocked about something new. If you're going to believe the Bible narrative, but if you're going to understand it was just a book that has no really, no serious basis, then you know it was just a book. Come on, think about it. Turn your minds on, start to think. That's on you, man. Word up. I'm out of here. Peace.